Hello and welcome back to episode 40 of Boating with Master Fish Plus. I am Master Fish Plus boating on the ocean. In the last episode, we made our way down the ocean and hung out with Goblin in the ocean. Uh, we need to heal. As I'm sure you remember from yesterday's episode, our team is beat to heck, so we're gonna heal. Uh, it's just me, as I said. No goblin, cause he is, he's gone. Uh, he, he, he just left, he's, he's not here, he's gone. Said he was going to space. I, I don't know what he's doing there, but he's in space now. Rest in peace. Anyway. Yeah, he'll, he'll probably be back at some point. No need to worry. I like Goblin. I'm pretty sure you guys like Goblin. So Goblin will be back. But we're going to try to get somewhere today. Hopefully we can get to Roran Island. And we don't get wrecked out in the ocean. Um, we even fought all these people? Oh, we haven't fought this guy. They say the trainer... Oh, this. Uh, the trainer tower has 99 floors. I believe that that is indeed the case. Um, where is the trainer tower? You're fairy water. We need to hit you with poison. I don't want to go to you. Don't want to go to you. We really go to Yeedy? Man, it feels like we're clicking. I know in the last episode we used Yeedy for everything. Oh, by the way, in the last episode, I just want to do a shout out to uh, my good buddy. Jordis for editing the last episode. It was very kind of him. Uh, I think he is a way better editor than I am. So, yeah. Thank you, Jordis. Um, Azumarill's dead. Like I was saying, I think we use Yi way too much. We don't have any other choices. Fairy water is really specific, you know? Fairy water with huge power, that's a that's a waterfall, that's play rough. I guarantee that, that Azumarill had huge power. Which is the same as pure power. Another ability. Both abilities increase the attack power, or double the attack power of the Pokemon who has it. Yeah, they're talking about the trainer tower. It's, um, it's the trainer tower. It's not much else specific about it. There's 99 floors. You, once you start, you can't, you can't heal or stop. Well, you can stop. You can just turn around and leave whenever you want, but you can't heal. So, remember how I said we can't buy ethers and elixirs? That's kind of the thing. You get items as you go through it, and as you get to higher levels, there's a higher and higher chance of getting ethers and elixirs, but you're pretty much trying to take on 99 floors of trainers without being able to restore your moves. HP is an insignificant factor to the sheer amount of moves that you're going to be using. Because it's not easy Pokemon. You're not in there fighting stage 1 and stage... or. Basic mons and stage one mons. You're in there fighting real competitive enemies. I am clicking toxic. What am I doing? Jeez. I'm here trying to explain things. I'm not even focused. You know, it's the episodes like these where I'm not focused where I lose people. I, I've noticed this trend. I paid attention. I can see the code. I wonder if this shell has something in it. Nope. Maybe we picked it up already. Uh... Did I use a repeller or did I cancel that? All right, I used one. Real quick, I want to check the map because we're talking about the trainer tower and it's right here, apparently. Can we get over there? Is it over here? Pretty sure we can fly to it once we've been there, so. We would, we would be smart to go and touch it. Um, are we north of it now? Or are we, are we, uh, 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 uh. Yeah, these people are talking about it, so I assume it's right around here. Maybe. Yeah, here we go. So right here is Robo Nurse. She'll heal your, she'll heal your dudes. Organic matter restored to full function. The trainer tower consists of 99 floors. To proceed to the next floor, you will have to defeat a guardian. Each fight will be more difficult than the last, but the rewards for winning will also get higher. When you reach the top floor, you will... Loading data failed. Exit 1. Yeah, so... 
It's just this. It's 99 floors of this. I am in insane enough to try to beat it, but I don't think we'll be able to do it in Nuzlocke mode. Um, I'm going to need GP and junk to order in order to get through there. Because we need to conserve PP, which means we need to be able to one-shot Mons at... What the heck is this? This is a... This is a seed? What the heck? I've never seen anything like this! I've never before witnessed a rock on the ocean. Hey, you man, fight me. Wait up. Hold up. Swimmer Zack. Ooh, good. We can psychic you. Aqua Tail? Pfft, nothing, dude. Get out of here with Aqua Tail. Is it just me or does it seem Virtua Ducks? Starting to underperform. I mean, he's taken hits well, but we have all these mons with with uh, shiny cards and platinum cards that just really are putting him to shame. Hmm, I don't know. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is gonna be a fighting type move. I I don't want to stay in. I have a bad feeling about whatever's coming next. I'm not going to stay in. Halunculus does not have that shield. I, I want to switch. I'm always... I feel like I'm always switching to Yeedy. When we have perfectly good mods, it's just... I'm afraid of an Ice Punch from Swampert. I don't want it. I don't want an Ice Punch from this Swampert. It flinched. Okay. Can we take him? Okay, good. See, that's what I wanted. I guarantee you would have survived an Ice Punch from that... Swampert because oh jeez. All right, guys, ready for final gambit again? Oh, really? You're not gonna do it? That was that Friday's episode that we kept running into final gamp. There it is, final freaking gambit. All right, that dude did not have much HP left though, so we're good. But Jiminy Cricket, that wasn't cool. That wasn't even slightly cool. That wasn't even a little slightly cool. We're gonna go war. Why? Because even a super effective surf from this Empoleon, it's not gonna, you're done. Flare Bliss is gonna take you out. There isn't a thing on this planet that can live that. Holy crap! <laughs> the only thing on this planet that can live that! <laughs> oh, there's a, there's a good moment. <laughs> Nothing on the planet. All right, well, uh, we found out what can survive a Flare Blitz from war. I honestly didn't think anything that would get hit, or that didn't resist it, wouldn't be able to live, but... Well, I'm wrong. War has, a, war has a lot of power, you know? War is a very strong boy. Girl. She's <laughs> a very strong girl. Uh, I'm kind of skipping through these swimmers, because... Well, we're going to end up grinding. I'm lost. How long is this route? I hate it. I don't mind it. Swimmer Saitama? Huh. One Punch Man, anyone? I know, uh, Saitama is a city in Japan before it's One Punch Man, but I've never been to Japan. Oh no! I don't like that. Mirror Coat doubles the damage of any special move to hit it, or in return, in the half. Taking damage, then doubling it. It's like counter, but for special moves. There we go. Yeah, Virtua Duck feels like he's a lagging because he doesn't hit very hard, and the Pokemon we're facing are just slowly getting strong enough to actually hurt him. So I need to figure out what we're doing with Virtua Duck. Do we evolve him and make him into uh, our special kind of sweepery sort of deal, or what? Because if we evolve him, he loses his massive defense. He loses frickin' base 200 plus defense. Which is incredible, but it just doesn't... Actually, you know what? No, we can't get rid of Virtua Duck, and here's why. He's a Data-type Pokémon, and he's the only one we've got. And Data-type just can't be hit by certain mons, so he could clutch a win that nobody, no one else on our team can. Because he just simply won't get hit. You know, we've seen this. We've seen Virtua Duck be unable to be hit. And having having psychic and all this junk really helps. Even though even though a crit psychic from him didn't take this polyrath down nearly as much as we wanted. 
However, Virtua Duck just ignoring hypnosis is what we want. That's great. I love it. Floatzel, that's what's coming out. <sighs> We're going to switch. We're going to switch to Izanag. You know, the other thing is, we only we have very specific mons for dealing with with uh, water and ice and all these swimmer mons, you know? We just have specific responses. That's why we keep ending up using Yi. Because he's a specific response to this situation. Pelistorm. Good grief. Um, I don't think Pelistorm is going to have anything that's going to hurt Izanagi. But normally, we want to just... <sighs> for any Mon that's going to hit us twice for free, I'm switching to a Mon that cannot be destroyed by the Mon in question. Ridiculous. What? <laughs> what did he use? <laughs> did he just... Was that a steamroller? <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Don't. Don't do that. Alright, Hale is gonna get him next turn. We're just gonna heal. Man, I didn't know he got Road Roller. That us nicknaming our there it is again. Us nicknaming our uh oh the hail stop. Darn it. Our Pelastorm is gonna be named Dio. It's gonna really That's just it, isn't it? He is that. He is Dio. Kono Kono Dio da. Oh, I gotta look that up. Is it Kono Dio da or Kono Dio ga? I can't remember. I don't speak Japanese at all. Did you know? I am, I am a, a, a unilingual. I don't know. I don't. I don't think they have a word for my level of not special. I guess that makes sense since being not special doesn't get a word. That's just, that's just average. That's just normal. It's what you are. Glad we were able to break this down together. Wait, ghost type moves can hit. Huh. I didn't know there was a single type of move that would be just normal effective against data type. Which begs the question. Why did you... Oh, I know I'm using Hex and then switching through moves because I have Curse Body and he has Curse Body. Really? <laughs> We're just trading disabled, disabled moves. Oh man, that hurt. Ooh, ow, ooh, ow, ooh, ooh, ow, ooh, ow, ooh, gosh, ooh, ow. Slow King. We got a, we got a response for Slow King. Kind of. Oh, I wish we still had our, our Froggy, our Venus, or Gabi, our, our, our guy, our dude, our boy, our Venusaur. Could have Mega evolved that Venusaur, too. Wait, who's our Mega? Oh, duh. It's Yeedy. Really not the, the best Mega, but... Hey, I'll take what I can get. Hmm. Hmm, you're gonna use Amnesia, huh? You're gonna go to sleep! That's what you're gonna do! You're having a bad dream. <laughs> what could be what could be your bad dream? Because you're literally getting eaten. What is a worse... What is a dream that's worse? I know. You're in you're in school, but you don't have any you're in your underwear. You don't have any clothes. That's it. <laughs> that's the worst dream. That's that's the worst. Ooh. Why am I skipping all these trainers? Because it's a long route. And we don't necessarily have to fight all of them. There's nothing here. Oh, there's a Pokeball back here. I see it. Oh, just what we needed, a max revive. Um you know, maybe we come back and play on this route, but, you know, recorded episodes like this, they're kind of story-driven, so... Wait, what the heck is this? Are you kidding me? It's just a side path we could have gone down to avoid everything? Alright. That's fine. We will need to grind. Oh my gosh. We will need to grind to level whatever uh, before we go and do the story thing on Roran Island. We will need to get to whatever level it is that we need to get to. The max level. 
or we won't make it. We will also almost certainly need to add... Uh, <laughs> I trying to remember his nickname. Goblin nicknamed him. Newt! Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> nah, -uh, not doing this dance. No way. You are not going to just sit around and click horn drill and agility on us. No. No. The way the rules work, if I'm a higher level, horn drill can't, like, it can't hit us. So we have to switch to our only higher level. Because, oh my gosh, if horn drill would have hit Izanagi right there, I would have just, I would have broken down. That would have been it. I would have, that would have been done. Oh, I should probably speak about this. Anybody who, like, is sitting around and, not that you're sitting around, but anyone who's waiting for my episodes to be at 10.15, which it, it says 10 a.m. in my descriptions of the videos, I realize, but it's, uh, it has to be, it has to be 10.15 because I guess that's the only time slot that YouTube will allow me to, it's weird. I can't pick, it's in increments of 15 minutes. But if you're sitting right, if you're sitting and waiting for the episode, they haven't exactly been on time lately, and I apologize for that. That is 100% my fault, and it is no good. There's no predicting that. I can't, I can't predict that, okay? I just can't. I went out to Homunculus, cause I knew he would dynamic punch this thing into the ground. Lapras lives on one, and it lands a 30% accurate one hit KO move. I can't predict this. I can't do anything to stop that other than just leave Yeedy out 100% of the time, and that's not gonna fly. I have to switch up the Mons. It, it just, it won't work otherwise. I can't do it. I just, I can't. Ugh. How'd I pull that off? I just, I don't know. I don't know, lady. I, I don't. Why would you do that? Why would you sheer cold me with your Lapras? I love Tomunculus. I loved him. He's the dream candy on him. You only get like five of those in the game. <sighs> Zoomer all, Zoomer all. Okay. Well, it's fairy type. We're going to get play roughed if I switch to that. We can only switch to Yidi. Yidi's the only Mon who can take care of this. And Yidi's at half health. So, we got to do this. We're going to go and we're going to click. We can't even Mega Evolve this turn. We can't do it. It won't work. It won't happen for us. We must try something else. See, there's the play rough. I don't want a huge power play rough. I just don't like the idea of that. It's not my favorite thing. It's not. It's not. What's a strong physical uh, grass type? Grass type move that isn't wood hammer. There's that one. Is it pedal dance? We can't learn pedal dance. Like, my only other option is Razor Leaf. I'm not doing Razor Leaf, you kidding me? I'm gonna Ice Punch you. Sludge Wave, come on, dude. Freeze, be frozen. All right. We're gonna heal, because I got a Wood Hammer this thing. I don't know if it's gonna... I don't, I don't know. You know, it's, it's a mixed... It's a, it's a bittersweet feeling losing someone like Homunculus, because Homunculus was a big, strong dude. But you know what? I will say this. Golurk has surprisingly poor stats. I thought Golurk's stats were a lot better. That's great attack, and, and that's it. Doesn't really have anything else. Um, we, we, we overclocked Homunculus to the extent that he could be overclocked. I mean, no guard, platinum card, all that stuff, that's as good as it. There are two people there. They are layered over each other. They are sharing the same space. That is incredible. You'd think it'd like tear a hole in reality. Anyway. Uh, Golurk stats, not the best, but we, we overclocked him as much as we could, and he really served his time, but now, maybe, we get to put on a, a Mon that is way, way stronger. Um, yeah, let's go in. 
All right, so we're here at the island checkpoint. Out of order! Healing that. Woody! What is it, punk? It's a girl. What is it, punk? This, this healing unit's not working properly. But uh, I heard there's a house near the ocean where you can hear your Pokemon for free. It's hard to do an accent in, a, in that voice. I'm gonna write a complaint to the government. Oh, yeah, okay. How'd you get through with a Ledian? Where the plateau is. I'm actually here to visit Roran's candy shop. Yeah, me too, dude. Can we fly here? This is music from... from the Digimon World games for the Nintendo DS. I don't know how I immediately knew that, but that is what this music is. Ooh, Super Rod, Super Rod. Fishing on the beaches of an exotic island truly brings out the best of a fisherman, wouldn't you agree? Yes, I would! Uh, yeah, I wanted the new rod. I only have one rod and I... You butthole! Uh, yeah, I'll go help your sister, dude. Give me an item for it. <laughs> My stupid brother thinks I'm stuck, but I'm not. I'm actually enjoying peace and quiet. <laughs> Alright. Guess, yeah, guess your brother should be smarter. Oh, we need an encounter out here. Oh, did we skip an encounter? Is that- does that route change? No, it's 109. We missed the Islet of Horus. Um, we'll go back there. We're gonna go back to the Islet of Horus. Where are we now? Is this just... Oh, I gotta get our stuff straight. Um, we're on Route 110, and that goes right up to the Roaring Plateau. So, let's check for grass, because I'd much rather have a grass encounter than catch another magic carp. Oh, sweet. We are ready. What do you gotta say? Why is the lodge empty? I'll drink orange juice. Fur it. Where's Mr. Kiwi Kiwi? Perhaps he went fishing. He likes to do that. This is, in, this is a very unlikely place. To, that reading. They'll try to find some reading. Usually Kiwi, Kiwi Kiwi's lodge is full of trainers willing to fight, but it seems that no one's here. That's because Kiwi Kiwi isn't. Fridge, better not use it. There's two, there's two pieces of furniture other than all the tables and chairs. One is a fridge, and the other is, that we can't use, the other is a bookshelf with probably no books on it. Again, I'm avoiding trainers, and now I have an extra good reason why. We're at five mons. We want to be at six. Hold up. Oh, sweet! The sun can't- Oh, come on, you can't do this to us! That ball's glowing! That ball is legit changing colors! Man, how'd they do that? Kudos to the developers. They're doing all sorts of cool stuff in this game. Oh no! This island is a great place to train. This island's a great place to take my friends from me. Uh, you're part dark type. So you're gonna hit us with everything under the freaking sun. Gosh dang it. Hurt. Hurt him. It didn't hurt. Good news is we can switch to a mon who's gonna decimate the competition. Unless you have horn drill. Please don't have horn drill. I've had enough of the one-hit KO moves. We could lose our whole party to one-hit KO moves. I'm gonna lead with Ezen. Really? You gonna you're gonna eat that much damage? We need a platinum card for Izanagi. I haven't done any money grinding in a long time, but we need to do some and then just I'm gonna go buy cards until I explode. Lediba. Now we're gonna stay out because you're about to catch the finest of wing attacks. Ooh, that looked like it hurt. Gotta get our golden egg out and start grinding. Oh, speaking of grinding. Bye, Blissey. Wow. Wing attack is not very good. What we need is Dragon Claw and... I don't want to get rid of wing attack, but what do, we, what do we do in place of it? There isn't anything better than wing attack, is there? Uh, we're just, we can't go around you now. Now we gotta go fight everybody. Thanks, blue hair. Like slide through there. Yeah, um... It is completely inconsequential as to whether we fight all these people or not. I'm just not gonna do it. Because, you know, that's a chance that we... We are gonna have plenty of Pokemon battles too, mind you. Don't worry. Just because we're missing some of these does not mean that... Ooh, sweet, another nugget. Does not mean that, you know, we're skimping on battles. Another meteorite shard. I got one of those out of the out of the fishing game back at the circus. 
So I'm not sure what those shards are about. Look, I just want to get up to up to the the plateau. Then maybe maybe you know, maybe then I'll come back down and I'll fight people. We can do an entire episode where I just I just go and fight all of the trainers that we ever have ever needed to fight. But there are there's one really big thing that I got to All right, what what are you doing? I once saw four elderly ladies carry off a guy to the top of the volcano. Is that a reference? Ah, jeez. Dermanitan. Oh, boy. Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. Okay, he uses U-turn. Well, that's good. You go out to hit him on top. Well, that's great. We're going to D-dance because you just dropped our attack. You going to go agility? Well, we're still going to be faster, I think. I'm going to go one more D-dance for plus two attack, and then we're going to shoot through his whole team. All right. We should be faster, too. We're not. Wow. That is a quick hit Montup. Quick wide garden hit Montup. I bet that was... I bet he was waiting to use counter on that one. Speed tie my butt. He was going to murk us. He was all like, I'm just going to wait. You will hand your head to me. I'm a hit Montup. Chestnut. Well, this could hurt or be a one-shot. It's going to be a one-shot. I don't know if you use spiky shield or not. Spiky shield stops us from hurting him, and then we take a little damage if we use the physical attack. All right, well, let's slide past you. Uh, oh. What, am I out of range? Great. All right, we're up on Roaring Plateau. I really think I am going to do an episode where I just go back and I fight all those hundreds of trainers. And you know what? It's probably just going to be a bonus episode. I'm probably going to do that for grinding and then just come back and I'll fight them all. I'll see if I can do that. Let's see if I can do that episode. I like grinding on the other enemies. Uh, enemies. On the pay, pay you trainers more, but I don't know. Maybe I'll stream it. That might be a good stream. Uh, we have some mons that we caught that are in the death box, right? Anybody in here alive? I mean, this is painful as all get out to do, but... Did you hear that? It was the cries of the danged. <laughs> uh, let's name this box... Life. Again. Um, who do we add to the team, then? Well, <laughs> his name goes off the screen. Newt! We could add Newt. Um, I'm kind of... I'm kind of wanting to add Captain to the team, since, you know, he's already going to be busted. Uh, that would be a really good add. But we do have someone that we can add to the team right away. But before we go and do that, I'll go do that in a few minutes here. We're just gonna shop so that when I go... <gasps> I went, oh, we got what we wanted. Finally, full restores. Oh, yes. Shopkeepers say that the Growlithe you see appeared one day out of thin air and that on some days he's there and on others he's not. A silver dog tag with the letters K-A-Z engraved into it. He's watching your moves intently. Oh, he's a smart one. Uh, all right. Oh, sweet, we got Draco shield. Anyone weak to dragon is now safe. Well, not safe, but safer. So let's look around town a little bit. Um, I want to explore this. Anton lets me stay here. He has a TV and air conditioning. Shy air conditioning. Oh, the Crystal Gatherer. Bring me four red Stardust, blue, four blue Stardust, and I can make a Stardust Crystal. All right, I'm going to be doing that. Probably in our stream episode again. I'm Yeah, things are getting added to the list of the stream episode. I should probably actually make that list a reality and write it down. Um, I know where that goes. This doesn't go anywhere we need to go. Uh, old man. Aurora. Aurora? Uh, some of your Pokemon like being here. Yeah, the ones that are alive definitely like being here. Woman. I look up to Eris, our gym captain. She's cute, I guess, in her own way. But people are usually scared of her and her menacing dwagons. 
I heard she once torched a challenger who tried to ask her out after losing the gym battle. So remember, if you're gonna ask her out, make sure you get the badge first. Jeez. Where did I put those shorts? Do you know? Well, these aren't them. <laughs> Good luck with your shorts, dude. <laughs> My man lost his shorts. <laughs> oh, look at this guy. Welcome to the candy shop. Do you have the good ones? Yes, you do. All right. What is this music? Is this the end of my show? No? Okay. I thought that was my out... <laughs> I thought that was my anime uh, season one ending theme. <laughs> There's a great question. What is your... What is your season... All right, guys. What's your season one... Oop, I forgot a candy. Or not a candy. A TM. Oh, <gasps> that's what we wanted. All right, I will be teaching that to Izanagi. Goodbye missing attacks. All right, let's go do the thing that ends off of this episode. Let's go to the auction. Yep, back to Silent City. It's nice to be able to fly and surf. We got so much to do. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to start splitting stuff up and do like stream episodes where we explore old areas and then story episodes that come out every day. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. We have a rare offer today. <gasps> <gasps> a beldum. Oh, it is time. <laughs> it is time to shine. I will pay any amount. Nobody. He's mine. Yes! We got him. My maximum titanium energy! Ah, it's building! Pure power! Oh, yes. No GP, no shiny, but still. I think we have a card for him, too. He only knows takedown, what? Ow. <laughs> Ow, only takedown? I didn't see that coming. All right. Well. That wraps up today's episode. Um, like I said, I'm probably gonna I, I'm gonna try to stream grinding. I, I find myself having like a pitiful amount of time to stream lately, but maybe we can start fixing that because I think that's the most fun way to do things. Uh, anything else? Anything else? Uh, I don't think there's anything else. We'll fix the team by the next episode. Yes, sirree. If you enjoyed today's episode, please like, comment, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications. It helps out the channel immensely. All right, guys. I hope to see you tomorrow for our next one. For now, farewell. <laughs> <laughs>